a protected pass bomb, but he will have to defend so precisely on the king side to survive that attack. I think Petrosian has great practical chances to win this game. Oh, indeed. And another idea is bishop f6, not just uh, taking this rook on e7, but I think what's the smart thing? Bringing the knight back to d5, covering the f6 square. Queen e4 check is possible. This knight can come into d6 if you want. It's getting very sharp here. And I do prefer white's position. I've made that loud and clear at this point, but I am not positive that there's a way to really crash through. It just may look better than it actually is. Absolutely. I'm also just switching back and forth uh, through the rest of the board because this is the final round. Every single board matters. So In this let's... position, I was very tempted to go over some B takes C5. Yo, Roku with the Twitch Prime hype train. But what I, I came to this... In this position, I thought back to uh, words of advice Hikaru told me. Hikaru told me that I shouldn't look for something that isn't there. And that I should just let the game come to me and that I should stay calm at all points. So in this position, I was calculating very concrete variations. But with Hikaru's advice in mind, I realized, holy shit, my position is so insanely good here. I just need to castle and put my pieces on active squares and the game will win itself. So I was very happy with that emotional decision making that I made in this position. Anyway, Eight, rook, F, rook, rook H6, rook? rook H6, King E7, Rook B7. That might be winning. Rook B7, King D6, oh, and Rook E8. Oh, oh gosh, what a tactic! He gets the rook. No, he says, wait a second. And the pawn, rookie one, you have to go rookie, rookie one. Rookie one, you got to stop it, get, get your king in. How, how quick is the king? B4, no, king my e4. Friends. Yeah, king e5, I think, even. Whoa. Okay. Are we sure so, about this? King d6, king e4, king c5, king d3. This is hard to win. This is winning, but hard to win, I think. King c2, I see. Rookie, you got to get watch more... XQC. I, I had some weird dream that I was playing, like, I was playing an Among Us game with him and Pokimane. And, like, it's like, I forget what it was, but XQC, I think, was an imposter, and it was just, like, yelling at me, like, nonstop. So, yeah, I, I have... Yeah, I did have an Among Us dream recently. It was just like, it was just weird. But yeah, that's good though. Maybe it's good, but it was just weird. But yeah, I literally like I, I had this dream, and when I woke up, I was like, what? It's like, why was I dreaming about Among Us? Like very. If I was in Dagu Body's position, could I win with the almost lost position, but more time? No, I mean I think if I had this position as Black against Hans, I mean, I don't, I don't even. The problem is it's not easy for Black to play. There's just no good moves. I think against Hans, I could probably draw this most of the time. But I would not win this position with black against Hans. I, it's just, it's that bad. The position is that bad here. Um, I think I could probably draw most of the time. But I, I there's no way I would win this with black against Hans. Um, do I think you have... Oh my gosh, he has rook g1. Oh, I thought I was completely saved. This dude, oh my... He's not going to see that. We're going to have to just flag him. Oh my... Oh my god. Psych! Weebs out. Weebs out. I mean, I speak more Italian than Japanese, but but yeah, Japanese, of course, is what I what I I mean. I'm half Japanese. I don't watch anime, not really. No, Kohi Deska. Yeah, this Kohi is very um. What's it? Daisuke? Yeah, Daisuke Death. Oh shit! Excuse me. I'll be right back. Sir. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna call a. Uh... Uh, a, uh, a ride, and then I'll be back maybe 15 20 minutes max. All right, cool. I'll play like a few board games until then. Okay, sounds good. Bye. All right, peace. All right, let's uh, do the takeover, the core black takeover of the stream. Let's go, let's go, let's do it. All right, let's go. I'm gonna lose a few games just so you guys have uh, lowered expectations of me. I want you guys to start believing that I'm some I am anywhere near Hans. I'm like. Oh, B7 Schacht rot. Hier, B7 Schacht. Yes. Wisst ihr was? Das läuft mir sowieso nicht weg. Den nehme ich erstmal. B7 Schacht. Oh nein, ich Idiot. Nein, nein. Ich voll Horst. Ich bin so ein Horst. Uh, so if Andrew is joining Cloud9 means he's a part of their team and he represents them. I represent him. Chess is gonna be big, guys. Wow. 
Why is the car stream so laggy? Oh, Hikaru is talking about how you wouldn't play E4. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, not much of an E4 player. Okay. So, can we get adoption? <laughs> Thank you, DJ. We check. No, not, not, not this way. Yeah, then we check in goes here, we check in. <gasps> that's good, that's good, because uh, when you draw all the arrows with the same color, it's confusing. <laughs> uh, but Just... all my... Uh, okay. Uh, everything disappeared, sorry. <laughs> uh, let's... Oh, you gotta play Rock G one. Ah. Ah. Oh no. No. All right. But Rock G one. I don't remember. One million. Yay. Thanks everybody. Nah, I, I good night. <laughs> He's still streaming, right? I'll raid him. Major 2200 at chess and I tried to I tried to learn some go from him, but I just I couldn't really get it. I tried. I mean, I I had a go set. I had some go tactics book and I tried to get into it, but just not just not good um at it. The longest game I ever played was about eight and a half hours. It was a it was in a tournament in Germany in Dortmund, um, and it was against Georg Meyer, the the uh, German grandmaster. Uh, game started at like three p.m., ended at like eleven thirty. It ended really really late. Couldn't. Oh, let's go. Whew. Oh. I was so close to flagging there. Oh, I was really close. I was like a near-death experience. Adopt a little penguin. Knit a little penguin jumper. Oh my. Oh, 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 oh my God. Oh my God. Give him a check, dude. Stop this nonsense. Oh God. Oh my, oh my, oh my goodness. He's trying hard. <laughs> Two queens. Whoa, this is so close. Go. <laughs> what? Oh, Levy. Oh my gosh. Did that really just happen? Wasn't he up 10 seconds when he took the pawns? Wasn't it 16 to 6 when he took the pawns on the h7 and g6? I I don't care. <laughs> oh my god. I don't care. Joga contra o Tata. Tem o Tata e o Guglu, né? O Guglu joga semana que vem só. Contra o Prag e Nananda. Prag. Muito nome difícil, né, desses países que jogam bem xadrez, né? Muito nome difícil. Olha quem fala, né? Olha quem fala. Na hora que eu falei, eu percebi. Eu tinha acabado de falar. Vidit é such a nice guy. So when he does that, you laugh and everything and everybody moves on, but like for example, if it, like if if I'm playing Blitz and I'm talking trash the whole game and then I make a horrible blunder, it's so much worse cuz then now the whole chat's like, ah! True. And... True. No, no, that's very true. <laughs> it's, it's it's hard. Uh with Vidit you want him to do we might get mated we might not we've got to try we definitely might get mated I
Rook F7. Oh my gosh, yep. Rook F7. I was going to say, you, know, you can even play D6, but Rook F7 is more powerful. You had to keep your pawn. Yeah, I think, I mean, maybe he saw it in the other version, but oh. Oh, hike. And Queen E5, Rook E7. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a mean guy. Well, I just know how Hayek is going to think about it. He's going to do it. He's not going to be able Person? to. Person? And as a chess player, in one move. In one move. That is... Oh my god, that is crazy. I am astounded at the move F6. I mean, F6 is disgusting. I mean, f frankly, I should be reporting Hikaru for that move. I mean, I mean that's just that's just disrespectful. That's just I mean th th